according to information published on the Russian social network VK on February 28, 2023. Russia sent its latest generation of local made 8x8 wheeled armored vehicles, Bumerang to the NVO, Novorossiya Renew Russia, Zone, also referred to as the Union of People's Republics, the Confederation, the self proclaimed Donetsk People's Republic, and the Luhansk People's Republic, LPR, in eastern Ukraine. One more time, the Russian Ministry of Defense will use the conflict in Ukraine to deploy its latest generation of boomerang-wheeled combat vehicles and perform field tests in real combat conditions. Just as in Syria, the new war zone in Ukraine is a perfect laboratory to carry out combat capabilities testing of the latest developments in combat equipment and military vehicles. The Bumerang is the latest generation of Russian-made amphibious wheeled armored infantry fighting vehicles, designed to transport troops and provide fire support during combat operations. It was developed by the military industrial company, VPK, and was first unveiled at the Army 2015 International Military Technical Forum Defense Exhibition in Russia. The design of the Bumerang is very similar to European made 8x8 armored vehicles, with the driver position at the front left side of the hull, the turret in the middle, and a troops compartment at the rear. The vehicle's hull is made of welded aluminum alloy with reinforced steel plates, providing protection against small arms fire, shell splinters, and shrapnel. The sides and rear of the hull are also sloped to deflect incoming projectiles. It also features advanced armor protection, including a combination of passive and active protection systems to provide high levels of survivability for its crew and troops. The Bumerang IFV is equipped with a remote control turret mounted on the roof, which is armed with a 130mm automatic cannon. 17.62mm coaxial machine gun, and two anti-tank missile launchers mounted on each side of the turret. The vehicle is equipped with the latest generation of computerized fire control system, including a multi-channel electro-optical sighting system and a laser rangefinder. The Bumerang is motorized with a YAM 784-stroke turbocharged diesel engine developing 550 horsepower, coupled to a 7-speed automatic transmission, and a hydro-mechanical drive system, providing the Bumerang IFV with exceptional mobility and maneuverability on a variety of terrains, including rough terrain, soft soil, and water. The vehicle can reach a maximum road speed of 100 km per hour. It can cross water obstacles at a maximum speed of 10 km per hour, thanks to two water jets mounted at the rear of the hull. The Russian Boomerang 8x8 VPK-7829 combat vehicle was developed by the VPK company in two configurations, the 25-ton K-17 Armored Fighting Vehicle, AFV, and a 22-ton Amphibious Armored Personnel Carrier, APC, designated K-16. Intended to replace heeled combat vehicles such as the BTR-80, in service with the Russian Army and Border Guards, Boomerang represents a new approach in all aspects a new chassis, more ground clearance, and significantly higher vehicle, new armor, and new armament. According to Russian defense sources, VPK is building new Boomerang prototypes for the planned state trials by the Russian Army. The Boomerang was unveiled on the May 9 parade in 2015, along with the Armada family and Kurganet's 25 AFVs. The Boomerang has an operating range of 800 kilometers. It is powered by a new 750 HP digitally controlled diesel engine, developed by the Yaroslav engine plant. It is coupled to an automatic transmission. It has a road speed of 100 km per hour and 50 km per hour off-road. On amphibious operation, the boomerang can swim at a speed of 5 knots, 10 km per hour.
Each vehicle is manned by a crew of three a commander, gunner, and driver. It can carry eight troops with their combat loads. Unlike the side access doors used on the BTR-80, the Boomerang uses a rear access ramp, similar to Western and BMP-type Russian APCs. Access hatches are also available on the top. Both versions use passive protection comprising a combination of steel and composite ceramic armor. Laser detectors and instant multispectral smoke dischargers offer a form of soft active protection, enabling the vehicle to maneuver under the smoke cover to avoid the hit. Multiple video cameras are mounted around the vehicle providing a 360-degree vision for the crew. The K-17 can also be equipped with the Afghanid hard kill countermeasures that utilizes radars to detect the threat and launches blast fragmenting countermeasures to intercept anti-tank missiles, anti-tank projectiles, including kinetic and rockets at ranges of 4 to 200 meters from the vehicle. To improve protection from mine blasts and improvised explosive devices, speed, the boomerang is higher relative to the previous generations of Russian AFVs. The additional height enables the blast's mitigation and opens some space for blast attenuating seats for the crew and passengers. The K-17 version uses a multi-purpose remotely controlled turret, mounting a 2A4230 mm gun with 500 rounds, 160 AP, 340 HE frag. This gun can effectively engage ground targets at ranges of 1.5-2.0 km, and airborne targets, such as helicopters and UAS, at a distance of 2.5 km. The turret also carries two pairs of Cornet D anti-tank anti-material guided missiles, stored and ready to launch containers. Cornet D is the domestic version of the export version of the weapon known as Cornet E.